carry on my wayward song. There'll be these when you are done. Nice. Thanks. Nothing funny there. <laughs> Welcome back to our Stupid Directions Unit. It's Corbin. We got the hits from the 70s. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank it's you for so on. juicy. Patreon, follow our official Twitter account. Ring the bell and heart the notification squad. We got the funk. What do we do? I have the foggiest idea. Today, I hey. know it feels like spring now and that makes me really happy. Uh, a new trailer dropped last night uh, from Red Chili Entertainment, which I believe is uh, SRK. Shahrukh Khan. That's his company, but he's not in it. Nope. He, he just, just produced, produced it. it. Money, money, money. It's called Har Kisi Ki Haisi Kambab. <laughs> <laughs> that actually, I'm going to call that one. Come on, everybody. Corbinized. It's been a long time. We need to have like fireworks and. and it has Horns and Sanjay Mish Mishra yep. and uh, Deep I say that Deepak Dobrio Dobrio, uh, which I don't recognize. But uh, new film coming out in March. Here's a presenting a trailer for the extra so extraordinary story of a character actor. Oh, star it's a story about a character actor. Sweet, I suppose. Uh, let's just go. I don't know anything else. <laughs> story of somebody like a lot of epic Indian superstars who have 500 credits, which is redonkulous mm -hmm. <laughs> to have 500 credits, um, that is looking for his 500th, right? And then just realizes that it's not really what he wants almost. Maybe find yeah. a second life or finding happiness that's not from stardom, maybe? Maybe so. Something yeah. like that, you think? Yeah, uh, maybe, maybe, you know, like... Um, I think this is true of an American actor named Harvey, <coughs> Harvey Keitel, mm -hmm. who I, I, I have heard had had frustrations that he never got the kind of leading man prowess of his contemporaries, De Niro and Pacino. Mm -hmm. And even Pesci, that didn't happen for either. They were supporting roles. They yeah. were always the side role, the character role. They were never considered the lead. 
they were never pitched the thing and was like, I want this to be a Harvey Keitel film. It was always, it's going to be a Pacino film, a De Niro film, and we'd like to get Keitel, you know? And it may be that. He may be the quintessential character actor who everybody wants to fill in the side role and does a good job of it, but maybe that wasn't his dream and maybe he made his identity too much of that. Um, I'm, I'm interested. It seems almost, because he did the cigarette thing, I don't know if I know. Because I'm pretty sure that's Rajnikanth. Yeah, um, that's like his deal, but I think... Um, Maybe they're saying he's like a. They're uh, he not doing, playing him, but they're. No, like, like doing something as a shout out as like an iconic movie legend, uh, or maybe he wanted to be a superstar like him and never okay. got to that level of fame. Gotcha. Uh, it's pretty iconic for. Yeah. Rajnikanth. Yeah, I mean, that's like. It isn't as iconic, but nowadays, if you do the big one eyebrow thing, oh, everybody yeah. knows you're doing Dwayne Johnson. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or if you wear one glove, you're doing you're Michael. You're doing Michael. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a stereotypical kind of thing. I, it has enough in it to make me think that it has the potential to be a pretty touching story. Also, it has a bunch of actors I don't yeah. know. I don't yeah. recognize hardly anybody. Me too. But I, that means nothing. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Oh. So if there's a bunch of actors in here that we should know about. Yeah, if you want proof that we don't care necessarily and we can still think a cast is spectacular and love a movie, just our most recent Come Along Jay Nights, we didn't know a single person in that thing and loved everybody in it. Oh. So it doesn't matter. Good acting is good acting. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm a, little, I'm a little hesitant. I can't tell definitively, but like we always say, we're never going to judge a film by the trailer in and of itself. So let, yeah. us, let us know. Are you excited for this movie? You know yeah. stuff we don't because you typically do, beautiful, stupid babies. Yeah. Uh, and how is, um, I know it's SRK, it's how is Red Chili's entertainment with what they've been putting out? It's a good question. Yeah, I don't know the answer what's their, what's their quality level between, you know, like um, something like Kumbalaji Nights and right. Lyra? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because we're not as versed yet. Like when we see films here that are done by a particular studio or a production house, we can get a gist like, immediately. If it's A24, if it's A24 we, know, we know it's going to be good. It's going to be a good film. <laughs> uh, that's just their track record. Yeah, um, but if it's like MTV, you don't, you don't really. Or Nickelodeon. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, you don't really know. Yeah, it's well, kind of the well, jury's out. out. What are we going to get with that thing? Yeah, so I let us know like how they are with their, their reputation and, and putting out stuff. Uh, and uh, if you're excited about this, uh, let us know down below. <laughs>